The solar eclipse on April 8th will occur in a 115-mile wide stretch from Mexico to Canada, crossing the United States. Here's a detailed breakdown of what time totality starts and stops in 13 states it passes through, according to NASA. Total solar eclipse will start in Dallas, Texas at 1.40 p.m. CDT, and it will end at 1.44 p.m. CDT. Then it will start showing in Idabel, Oklahoma at 1.45 p.m. CDT, and it will end at 1.49 p.m. CDT. In Little Rock, Arkansas's totality will begin at 1.51 p.m. CDT and end at 1.54 p.m. CDT. Then, at 1.56 p.m. CDT totality, will enter in Poplar Bluff, Missouri and end at 2 p.m. CDT. For Paducah, Kentucky totality will last from 2 p.m. to 2.02 p.m. CDT. From 1.59 p.m. to 2.03 p.m. CDT totality will appear in Carbondale, Illinois. After Illinois comes Evansville, Indiana, where totality will start at 2.02 p.m. and it will end at 2.05 p.m. CDT. In Cleveland, Ohio, at 3.13 p.m. EDT totality will begin and ends at 3.17 p.m. EDT. At 3.16 p.m. EDT totality will begin in Erie, Pennsylvania, and it will last for four minutes until 3.20 p.m. EDT. For Buffalo, New York totality will begin at 3.18 p.m. EDT and it will end at Buffalo, New York. From 3.26 p.m. EDT to 3.29 p.m. EDT totality will show in Burlington, Vermont. In Lancaster, New Hampshire beginning time is 3.27 p.m. EDT and ending time is 3.30 p.m. EDT. At last comes Caribou, Maine, where totality will last for two minutes from 3.32 p.m. EDT to 3.34 p.m. EDT. Furthermore, the partial phases of the eclipse last about an hour and 20 minutes before and after totality and will be visible to some extent across the entire United States. Thank you for watching. Click the subscribe button and hit the bell icon so you don't miss any video.